Police are searching for a gunman who opened fire in Kensington earlier this morning, killing a man and critically injuring two women. It happened about 3 o'clock this morning near D Street and Indiana Avenue. The injured women were rushed to Temple University Hospital, where our Joe Holden is standing by live now. Good afternoon, Joe. Jim, good afternoon. Both those women in uh, critical condition. Now, an early theory, according to police sources, the male victim who was pronounced dead at the scene, sources say made a pass at a woman inside a local bar, and then moments later, gunshots were fired. Philadelphia police officers scrambled to get a gunshot victim to the hospital. Three people were hit by bullets at D and Indiana. A 31-year-old man was pronounced dead at the scene. Two women were taken to Temple University Hospital. Police say their conditions are critical. People were rattled awake by the sounds of gunfire. Four shots went off. One, two, three, four. And then there was a, like a two-second pause. And then three more shots went off. I said, oh, my God, this is close. We've blurred video of the victims due to its graphic nature. Police Chief Inspector Scott Small walks us through the moments before the shooter unloaded his weapon at 10 minutes to 3 on Monday morning. Our real-time crime cameras did capture the victims all standing around a red vehicle. And at one point you see one of the females actually in the red vehicle and then she exits the red vehicle and that's when the shooting occurs. And police tell me those real time crime cameras did not actually pick up the shooting. So homicide detectives are pounding the pavement for surveillance video again. There is a shooter on the loose right now and police want to hear from anybody who has information. We're live outside Temple University Hospital. Joe Holton, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Joe, thank you so much.